today we're going to be talking about uh, pathophysiological concept maps and this particular patient has a diabetic with a below the knee amputation. So the first thing we need to do is to um, name the map and let's make some notes about what the concerns might be for this person. Okay, so let's add our central box here, below the knee amputation, BKA. Uh, let's see, I want to collect some past medical history. Um, diabetes, well, you might have guessed that. Congestive heart failure. And he's got some hypertension, which, given his diabetes, makes sense. Let's update the primary admitting diagnosis. And we're going to want a, a legend. We're going to be color coding uh, a lot of the elements in here. And you'll find, of course, with spider scribe, you move things around. And, uh, you know, hopefully that just makes it you know, simpler as you're, when you're done, that things are organized in some fashion. So we've got some uh, admission, uh, an admission assessment. Uh, we're looking at his physical condition when he comes in. He's got a five centimeter necrotic wound on his left heel. And the pedal and posterior, posterior tibial pulses are not palpable. Both feet are cool to the touch. Lower extremities are slightly cyanotic. And his temperature is 37.9, which is a little elevated. Pulse is 100. And uh, respiratory rate of 28 with elevated uh, blood pressure and, of course, serum glucose. So I'm going to start color coding some of these things. And you know, Spider Scribe's color backgrounds are just a little on the limited side. Come back for part two and we'll add a whole lot more.